Through Romania to find out in the street what people really think about Andrew Tate. I mean, obviously we just got done with our long interview and we're trying to figure out what the people here really do think because the reality is we're told one thing over the United States or the rest of the world and if the people don't believe that here, then how can the rest of the world really believe the truth? So I think we, being all the way out here, we would be doing ourselves an injustice if we didn't find out what people really thought. So let's go ask some people. So, what do you guys think of Andrew Tate? I think he's a sexist. You th sexist? Well, I think that he has opinions that are not very accurate mm. against women. Do you think he deserves to be in jail like he is here? Or yeah. how he was? No. I don't think he's done anything to be in jail. I think that he says no. things that are not necessary to mm. be said that are not really true. So, you don't agree with his viewpoints, but you don't believe he d belongs in jail? No, because that's his opinion. It's, that shouldn't get him in jail. That do, shouldn't... do you think most people here feel the way you do? Or what do you think most people here think? Well, I personally don't hate him. I mm. think he's... I've never met him, yeah. obviously. But, you know, I don't think he deserves to be in jail. But I think that a lot of women think the way I think because most of his opinions are against women. But I don't think it comes out, out of hate. I think he just has this sort of mindset and he was raised that way but that's you know that's different everyone's different awesome thank you all right so what do you think about Andrew Tate I think that uh, not everything what he says should be taken as a pure coin because sometimes he talks big but it's some of it for fun yeah <laughs> do you think most people in Romania think like you um, I don't know. do you think he deserves to be in jail no, no. because he have uh, made most many people to overcome a depression and etc. Do you think he helped you at all? Yeah, at some point. Some point, a little bit. Yeah. Awesome. So, what do you think about Andrew Tate? Um, all right, I have a lot of thoughts about Andrew Tate. Uh -huh. But one of the things I do think is that there's right now a lot of there's an epidemic of uh, lonely and angry young men mm. who are seeking for some sort of male role fit, role models and figures in their lives. And when those lack, I think Andrew Tate's rhetoric uh, introduces them to a kind of anger and hatred towards women to expect something from them and to think that there are certain roles in society that must be fulfilled for one sex and the other sex and I think that's incredibly problematic because uh, as, as, as young men you're taught to expect something in return and that if you become the best version of yourself then the woman will like you and if that doesn't happen then it's the woman's fault and so I think that creates an incredibly dangerous situation in which men are constantly expecting to be rewarded by women for their actions and that leads to a lot of men being angry when they're not rewarded mm. and then blaming women for things that they're not supposed to be blaming them for and so I think if you analyze his rhetoric you're constantly going to see him th say things which lead to expectations that are problematic and so I don't know whether he deserves to be in jail or not there's been things said that he has contributed to the uh, uh, sexual trafficking of women in, in Romania and that's why he's here and not in the United States these are things that I'm not entirely uh, educated on but if you analyze his rhetoric I do think that there's much better role models for young men such as mm -hmm. myself and others than to listen to someone who's constantly looking for a way to get into the media by saying things which are sensational well I think that's fair you know each people each person can have their own ideas on whether or not you agree sure um, everyone's entitled to their own opinion I think that's completely reasonable and expected absolutely you're not gonna find everyone that loves everything he says absolutely not. but the reality is is do you think he belongs in jail for having views like that I, I don't think I don't think anyone's ever said that Andrew jail uh, Andrew Tate belongs in jail for having views there's mm. freedom of speech in every single country if you look at the case against Andrew Tate the case is for human trafficking for the traffic of women who have admitted that they've been brought to Romania in order to be sold or to be on chat sites for which he receives large sums of payments so no one's saying that he's being put in jail for his opinions they're saying that he's been being put in jail for doing things which are by statute illegal in America and other parts of the world but are not in Romania. Those are the things that are being said, not that people are disagreeing with him and wanting to put him in jail. So the things that he's accused of may be illegal in other countries, but not illegal 
in the country in which he's actually being tried. Sure, and slavery is... That's crazy, isn't it? That is crazy, but slavery is illegal in some parts of the world and that doesn't make it right. So the fact that it's illegal somewhere and illegal elsewhere doesn't mean that from an ethical standpoint you can be against it. And so, yes, perhaps in Romania it doesn't go against the laws, but I suggest that if he'd like to, you know, uh, continue speaking his points to go somewhere else in the United States and see how he'll be uh, accepted. But I don't think he'll be able to do that for legal reasons. So that's why he's in, you know, Romania and not his own home. Do you think people here feel the way you do more or feel compared to uh, kind of the other views that we got? Where do, you, where do you think people in Romania lie? I think people in Romania and Eastern Europe in whole are much more prone to these forms of uh, uh, conservative viewpoints that are rigid in terms of the divide between men and women. And so I think he's tactically chosen to come here in Romania where men absolutely have different views on, on women and their expectations and what is expected of them to which allow him to have the safe haven here where people will protect him instead of going to some, I guess, more uh, critical places elsewhere in the world. And I'm not saying that's wrong, of course, everyone's entitled to their opinion, like you say, but there's a reason that one of the most famous figures in the world is not elsewhere in the Western world and is hiding in uh, a poor Eastern European country. Awesome, thank you. Thank you. About Andrew Tate, can we ask about him? Uh, it's a great man. Yeah, great man? Yeah, I like him. What do you think? He's like rich. Him. He's rich? Yes. I want to be like him. Really? Yes. What do you think people in Romania think about him in general? Uh, something good because uh, they teach young men to be men, you know, uh-huh. and uh, girls doesn't uh, accept him because, you know, they will not like men to be like him because they are uh, smart, you know, and will become strong. I don't know. Something like that. Do you think he, be, he deserves to be long in jail because he's getting arrested here? No, I don't think. No. No. I no? don't know. I don't know. You don't know? No. I don't know. Do you think most, why do you think they try to put him in jail here? Because so much people uh, liked him and uh, he influenced us good, Mm. you know? Yeah, and it's too much corruption here, you know? Corruption? Yeah. Awesome, thank you. Are we good? Yeah, yeah. Alright. Alright, so what do you guys think about Andrew Tate? Very good opinion, very good, very good. You like it? Best. Well, I think he has put Romania on the map. Uh-huh. Like, he has made Romania more famous. So people have become more aware about the country. So, yeah, overall a good opinion. He also has some good opinions about uh, masculinity. Mm. And people would describe it as toxic. But I would say that uh, men nowadays have... Uh, have lost their masculinity overall. Do you think most people in Romania support him, like him, or don't like him? Uh, I would say they're neutral. They would say that, yeah, he's good, that he did some things, like people are coming here and they're like, yeah, where's Andrew Tate's house? <laughs> I've had some friends coming from overseas and they were like, Where's Andrew Tate's house? Can you take me there? And he even has a pin on maps. Yeah. Andrew Tate's house, yeah. Have you guys been by there before? What? To Andrew Tate's house. Oh, Have you no. seen by? No, uh, no. I've seen by once, huh? I think, yeah. But I've never been there. Yeah. Overall, I think he's a good guy. Yeah, but like after the ban, like yeah. when he get banned, like the Romanians forgot about him, but some of them like get their lives better after yeah. listening to him. But it's like the media, you know, like they hiding some stuff. And that's kind of bad, yeah. because they only show the bad part, and like other people say, like yeah, he's a misogynistic or he's bad or. But no, nah. if you listen to all the podcasts, you will learn a lot of stuff. Like me, I learned a lot of stuff. Yeah. It really? motivates me. Yeah. So do you listen to his podcast? Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot. Awesome. We just recorded with him four hours today. Oh, nice. It's gonna go live maybe next week. Definitely check it out. Okay. Nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah of awesome. Thank you guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Hey, appreciate it. Enjoy the night. Thank you very much.